This is the coolest scientific paper I've read in a while. A big question in science is whether evolution is driven by gradual changes over time in reaction to an equally changing environment. In other words, is it possible for evolution to happen abruptly? Because most of what we see in evolution has taken millions of years to happen. For example, we know from scientific evidence that it took approximately 6 million years for us to evolve from our ape-like ancestors to what we are today. So knowing that, it seems scientifically improbable to develop a major evolutionary trait overnight. But the thing is, we do have biological elements that suddenly appear and scientists have no clue how or why. It remains a total scientific mystery. And one of those scientific mysteries is in all of our bodies right now. Myelin, the fatty protective coating that insulates our nerve cells, suddenly appears in the evolutionary tree of vertebrates 500 million years ago. There is no trace of myelin prior to the arrival of vertebrates in the ancestral line. This is mind-blowing information for several reasons. Firstly, myelin is arguably the most significant innovation for our nervous systems to ever occur in the animal kingdom. This one development allowed vertebrates lightning fast transmission of information across long distances from head to toe practically instantaneously. That would not be possible without myelin. As a result, the leap in cognitive abilities between vertebrates and invertebrates is dramatically significant because of this single change. And it's not only cognitive, think of the physical speed between dogs, humans, and dolphins versus invertebrates like slugs, worms, and starfish. Here's the second mind-blowing factor. We have two different types of myelin. We have Schwann cells for our body and oligodendrocytes for our brain. It is very specific. Up until now, we had no idea how this was even possible knowing what we know about evolution. And now we have the answer. A new study published in the journal Cell discovered that the genetic instructions to make myelin were slipped into our vertebral ancestors' DNA by a virus. A virus gave us myelin. Like, COVID or the flu. How and why did this virus give us this incredibly advantageous trait? It came from retroviral DNA. Myelin is the result of an ancient virus that embedded its viral genetic code into our DNA that has now become a permanent fixture. And it's not the only one. Surprisingly, 40% of our DNA comes from retroviral infections. Interestingly, there is only one vertebrate in the entire world that did not develop myelin and it's the lamprey eel. Just add it to the list to all the mysterious and strange facts about eels.